In this video, I'll be describing the spot color adjustment tool in the DFE client. Uh, when you bring a job in, like I showed earlier, that has a spot color in it, and you go to the full job editor here, you'll see this uh, icon that kind of looks like a pants on a book that's spread out. I'm going to select that, and it brings this window open. It is, here shows you all of the spot colors that are in the current job and the, the name and also shows me the CMYK mix that we're using right now. If I want to alter that what I can do is select the one I want to alter and then hit the printer button here and it brings up our swap sheet. Now by default it's going to grab uh, the two colors that are most dominant in the job and in this case it's going to be magenta and yellow. Up here I have got color steps and this dictates how far my color steps are going. And you can see up here my yellow for instance is going 40, 50, 60, 70, 80 and my magenta is going 80, 90 then obviously to 100. I'll then select the stock I'm going to print on whether it's 8.5 by 11 or different orientations of envelope and if I hit this it's basically telling me it's going to go ahead and output this one sheet. I can then select, I can then use the printed pieces to look at, compare the printed swatch sheets to either the Pantone book or a previously printed sample I'm trying to match, and I can select the color that most likely or most closely matches that. And then let's say for instance it's this color, if I select it, now that one pops to the middle here, and I'm going 10% increments off of this, and I can dial it down to say 5% and print another one. And then let's say for instance it's this one again and I can even go I can go all the way down to a half a percent basically. Uh, do that a couple different times when I'm happy with what I have and I select it and it, that's the one with the dark outline around it and I hit the check mark box that's my new mix for that color. Now at this point I can do both colors uh, or I can go ahead and I can apply it to adjustment sets. So I can either create a new one or apply it to a set I've already have in the system. I'll just apply it to that one, hit the check mark, and that color is done. That is how we use the spot color adjustment tool on the DFE.